Hear me, hear me, hear me. Hear me, hear me, hear me. Scooby do we do we Scooby do we do we Oh, where's my controller? Okay. I found it! Oh, I'm getting good! Oh. Turn this on, move over here, start the game. While I load up chat. Yay, chat. Yay, 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 chat. Yay, chat. Hey, 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 chat. Do, do, do. Do 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 Yes. Jackie on. Jackie on. Welcome to the stream, man. Boom! Let's hit chat only, so that I don't drain my battery so fast. It's filled with nostalgia. <laughs> ah, lols. Wait, is the game really that loud, people? I love this game. So do I, lols. So do I. I'm really sad what happened to the company, uh, THQ, and freaking that other uh, Vigil Games. I'm really sad what happened to them. And that they got separated. So let's try right there. Let's see if that's good for the sound. Come on. Come on, load up. You can do it. You can do it. Okay, that should be good for the sound. I do love this game. I'm going to see if I can beat it just today and tomorrow. This weekend. It's all about this game. Oh. Dark Siders. Yes. Uh, we'll we'll turn down the background music just a little bit. Okay, so right there is good. And sensitivity, yep, 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 we're good. Subtitles, awesome. We are good, people. Saving. I prefer this game over the sequel, to be honest. Yeah! Um. Actually, no, I really liked Darksiders 2. I loved how large it was and all the random loot drops. Uh, that was awesome. We'll overwrite the existing autosave file. Do you wish to continue? Yes. We're just going to do it on normal. I do really enjoy this game. I, I like the sequel. The sequel's pretty awesome, though it has a totally different play style. I was really looking forward to, you know, the rest of the series, but... Well, that may never happen now.
Which makes me sad. Also, uh, Tachyon, I was not doing the shader for you. Time, the armies of heaven and hell have waged an endless war. Drawn to the conflict was the Charred Council, an entity bound by ancient laws to preserve order and balance. It held that any great power, unchecked, threatened the very fabric of the universe. In time, heaven and hell can do honor the Council and its laws, for none were beyond the swift and terrible justice of the Council's enforcers. A fearsome brotherhood known as the Four Horsemen. Amid the turmoil, the first humans emerged. The Council foretold that these weak but cunning creatures would someday be integral to the balance. Thus, a third kingdom was named. The Kingdom of Man. By order of the Council, a truce was forged between Heaven and Hell. The Great Pact was bound by seven seals to be broken at the appointed time, when Man's Kingdom stood ready for the End War. A battle that would bring balance and determine the ultimate fate of the Three Kingdoms. Bom bom bom. Amazing backstory. So, opening cinematic. Yay, openings. Still just want to play as the other two horsemen, but no! I know, company had to j off and go bankrupt, huh? Here they. I mean, honestly, people, would you stand there staring at this giant brute of a beast that came out of a meteor crater? Bum, bum. Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 has become rare now due to Disney. Oh, yeah, because they own uh, Marvel. Yeah, truth is, we may never get another Marvel vs. Capcom game. Boom. Uh, okay, so there's the dash step. Square, 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 boom. Okay, so it's a circle. Because, honestly, people, war is a badass. That's the only reason why we like playing as him.
Yes, I totally agree. I would love a new Marvel vs. Capcom game. Of course war is here. Bitch, no one stops war. Can't I transform back? Whoa, what is happening? Who is this big guy chained up? Boom! I know, I've already played this game, but I need to do this for people who don't. I know a lot about this game. Cool, lol. Oh, shit. Angels. Damn it. I just lost like four health bars. So just to be clear, this is one of the easiest games I know of to get the platinum trophy on a uh, PlayStation Network. If you do PlayStation Network, basically to get a platinum trophy, you have to get every single achievement slash trophy in the game, which you can do in one run of this game, as long as you pay attention right here at the beginning and here a little later in the game. As long as you pay attention to what you're doing and know what's coming up, you can in fact get the Platinum Trophy one run, which is really amazing for any game. Who is shooting at me? Angels! Hold up, guys. Okay, check, check. Okay, I'm back. Yes, uh, Tachyon, this is Darksiders. This game is amazing and awesome. And it's like, the, the best way people have ever described it is it's like Devil May Cry with Legend of Zelda style dungeons and gameplay. So like you collect heart pieces and items and stuff and move through dungeons. And I'm pressing the wrong button again. 